It was a Balrog. <laughs> Go back to father. It's a long way. No, not in the water. Hair in our dress? Oh no, it's the uh, belt. Oh, you can't even wash yourself. Okay. Odd. So beautiful. <laughs> Teresa, I'm glad to see you. It feels nice to be in Skeletts here. Could have given us a horse though. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's a very serious crime stealing the king's silver. Stealing the king's silver is a capital crime. You get the pie for that. Why do you keep going on about it? What's it got to do with me? I keep telling you, I don't know nothing about any silver. I'm a miller. Flour is what I know about. If someone's stealing silver from the mines, why don't you talk to the mint master about it? For the counterfeiting. We did. He was the one that brought it up. It's our job to ask everyone who lives nearby if they saw anything suspicious. Then good luck with that. Because in case you haven't noticed, he sounds everyone Australian. around here lives near the mines. I... But some live closer than others. And then there's also the fact that... How to put it? We're asking you because... Well, you're a miller, right? Mm. Oh, I see. <laughs> Since I'm a miller, I must be a crook. Is that it? No, but you know what they say. Aye. They say you lot can hardly find your own asses. Never mind a thief. You're keeping me from my work, young fellas. So if we're done here, farewell and good luck. All right, Miller. If you should happen to hear anything, let us know. Okay. Wait, I'm not Miller. <laughs> Do I know how expensive the horse is? Eh, yeah, I suppose. It just, there's a lot of walking. Mm. And she hasn't got that much stamina. I went for those nails, but the blacksmith is with Sir Radzik today. All right, leave it till tomorrow then. No hurry. Right now, I need something else. Quick. What's up? Looks like he's dying for the a fix of drugs. The guards were here asking around. They said someone's been stealing silver from the mines. Can you go and tell Stebor? He went to check the fish trap below the bridge. Okay. Hmm, all right. I'll go and talk to him. Stibor. Warn Stibor. Has he been stealing silver? The family silver. Uh oh. Pass at me. The guards were here asking about silver going missing from the mines. Oh shit. Oh shit. All right, 
All right. Listen, Tess. I need your help. Tell me everything. Just say the oh. word. What do you need? We need to pick up a sack from one of the mine shafts. I don't suppose it's a sack of flour you're talking about? It's... it's silver ore. Sweet Jesus. You fellas haven't the sense you were born with. But family is family. Thanks, Tess. I'm sorry to drag you into it, but I can't manage it on my own. Where did you hide it? That's the thing. It's at the bottom of a flooded shaft. Samuel was working there before. You dragged Samuel into it too? No, no. Samuel knows nothing about it. So why don't you just go and get it? I don't know how to get to it. For heaven's sake, Stebor. Do you know where it is or not? Yes, but you see, when I was carrying it out, they stopped me. I was standing on this wooden walkway and I dropped it over the edge so they wouldn't catch me with it. And now I don't know how to get to it. All I know is it made a splash when it fell. And how are we supposed to find it? Go crawling through the whole mine? No, I've got an idea. Samuel knows that area. He he'll know how to get to the shaft. Oh no, Stebor, forget it. You're not going to drag Samuel into your dangerous game. Why don't you just leave Christ, the no, what sack. do you take me for? All he has to do is draw a map. And we'll do the rest. I don't see... I don't understand. The guards are asking after the silver. So he needs to get the sack of silver. So what, you can have it at home? When the guards ask again and then find it at home? That doesn't make any sense to me. Um, okay. Are you sure it's the same shaft where Samuel was working? Definitely. There's no other flooded shaft in the mine. Remember when everyone was talking about how they hit a spring and had to abandon it? Uh, all right, let's get the map. All right, Stebor. I'll go to Samuel and get the map from him. Have you got something I can give him to draw it with? Here. Give him this. I try to get it from him without giving the game away. Otherwise, Pa will have a fit if he finds Your out. Your mother has I'll three horses, Fairby? Where is wow. Sammy now? Where do you think? I saw him heading for the fish pond, as usual, to avoid work. Once you have it, come and meet me at Wenceslas Corridor on the hill. I'll be waiting there. Yeah, I get that, Per. Yeah, maybe it is a lot of money, but... Isn't... Like... Isn't the point that we're evading the soldiers? Like, we approached him saying there were soldiers asking about the missing silver. And he went, oh, shit, 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 shit. So surely the objective then becomes hide it or not make sure we've not got it. Not let's make sure we've stolen it properly. Essentially, I don't really get the motivation to go back. Apart from greed, which doesn't make any sense, because now Teresa's involved. Either way, it, we're going to run into trouble. It's what we do. That I would understand more. If they saw him drop the sack and that's why they were asking, that makes more sense. But then again, wouldn't you go and find the sack first as soldiers? It could be a trap. Vinter, Primo, and Kazak are the names. Did I say that right? Because. Zach. That's awesome. Do you do you ride yourself? Fair by? Like not not ride yourself. Do you ride horses? <laughs> you can ride. Wow. Horses scare me. I I'm not a fan. And the thing that about horses that scare me is their teeth. It's very irrational, but I I don't like the fact they have 
human looking teeth. It scares the hell out of me. We've got loads of horses around where we live. Um, thankfully, the closest we can get is they'll come to like a fence and, and like their he heads will come over and you can pet them if you want. It scares me. A bit bigger, yes, slightly bigger. Um, my little sister, Rage, um, she did some riding lessons when she was very young. I didn't partake, though. Is it over the river? Yeah. Come across. Jesus, it's not as shallow as it looks. Jesus. Uh, there's a, something about horse riding that also I don't understand. Is um, what are the rules about horse riding around your area, Fairby? Can you go on the roads? Is it legal? Sam oil. Sam, Sam oil. My God, Samuel. what happened to you? You look like you've been assaulted. <laughs> All right. Sammy, I need something from you. Oh, Tess, I just got ready for fishing. Don't worry. I just got ready you for don't fishing. Have to go anywhere. Remember that mine shaft where you used to work before it got flooded? Yeah, it was a deep one. We went down that morning. I haven't seen that we picture of her, no. Water. Master Faithfar said that always happens when you dig deeper than the drainage at it. We dug a well to slow it down, but even that wasn't enough. Do you think you could draw me a map of the way there? Why? What on earth would you want that for? Hmm. A family problem. You'll just have to trust me, Sammy. It's very important. It's a family problem. I might have known it'd be some Miller intrigue game. It's no wonder the folks say the things they do about us. Give me that and I'll draw it for you. Nightmare warning. I don't warning. even want to know any more about it. Uh oh. Do I want to click this? Yeah, no. It's like when you Google, uh, what is it? Um, is it like a... Yeah, Google hairless bear. You see a bear without any hair? It's, it's terrible. You've seen that, yeah. Ugh. Uh, I'll go straight to Stibor. Give me that and I'll draw it for you. I don't even want to know what it's any more about it. Thanks. That will help me a lot. We have to wait for him, right? Oh, Fortress Stibor. Do we have the map? Oh, I guess we do. A hairless huge rat, yeah. All right, guys. I'm going to take two minutes and brew myself a coffee because I am yawning like no tomorrow today. I don't know why. Uh, I won't be long. Uh, just stick with us. Uh, let's go over here. Hopefully, um, we won't... Uh, look, you can see Jenny in the background. <laughs> won't be too long.
shouldn't whistle. <laughs> uh, oh, 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 oh. There we go. Cool. Uh, did you hear what? Uh, did you hear what we're going to? I just went to make a coffee. I am. I don't know why I'm yawning so much, but I went to brew myself a cuppa, as they say. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Apologies, apologies. I should maybe have it like some some text or something that says it. Maybe. <laughs> no, I um I thought I'd make us off cuppa, and um they just got back from their walk, so I said hello to Sam as well. Well, I say I, I say I said hello to Sam. Sam bit me on the leg, and then decided to um try and play with me. <laughs> yeah, it went away, and then it's back again. I don't know why it does that sometimes. Back to father. I think that's what we're doing, isn't it? Oh, no, Stibor. We did that. We went back to father. Can I... Tr no, I can't pass wrong. Sam ever done some mischievous stuff? Sam always does mischievous stuff. Um, he, like, he won't let you wear socks in the house anymore. So, for some reason, he loves socks, especially if you wear any socks. Um, so, if you walk around the house with socks on, he will, like, try and bite the sock off your foot. But he, he tries to do it in a way that's, like, not painful to you so he he kind of like he like picks the top of it and tries to pull it away from your foot so if, essentially we we always walk around without any socks on um he also tries and steals your shoes so at the moment he's actually wandering around with well he used to have my trainer in his mouth um and he loves to chew on laces he's he's a menace <laughs> Yeah, I should. We should train him to stop doing that. You're right. Um, I think he only really does it um, sometime. Well, more often than not, he does that when he's overtired. So he'll be, he'll go for a walk or something, and he'll come back and he'll know he needs to sleep to recover his energy, um, but he doesn't want to. So he gets a bit grumpy and kind of acts out like a little kid. Murphy does the same thing. Oh, you have a patented dog. <laughs> I like the idea. I patent the the creation of a dog. <laughs> yeah, I can only imagine what it's going to be like when we have somebody round the house as well. So it, it needs to stop. It's just he's, he's young still. But it's the best time to teach them though, isn't it? I don't know. We need to see Samuel. Yes. I got that map from Samuel. What now? Great. Well, first, we've got to get into the mine. That fool Nimoy is keeping To the mines! Up. It'd be best if we split up. I'll get rid of him. You can sneak in. 